you guys start Bane Tech, and I'm actually kind of excited to bring you this video because I'm trying out a few different things. One, I'm using my OnePlus to to record this, so I want to get your feedback on the video and also the audio quality. What's it sound like to you? I'm going to try to leave it alone and not do too much editing as far as cleaning up the audio and stuff like that. I'm really curious to see what this is going to be like. Plus, I'm shooting this in 4K. I usually only do 1080p, but I figured why not give it a shot? I can get 10 minutes worth, and I'm sure I can do 10 minutes worth of video for a phone case. I've got the LG G4, and this is Varus's case for it. It's a very nice case. I like their lineup. What I like about this case is it's got a different kind of like feel and texture than what they've offered in the past. It's got that two-tone kind of design, but it's also got some really good protection as well. I really like these kind of cases because they're protective and they look good. One thing I do regret about it, though, is that it did scratch up a little bit over here, and that's because I actually got this stuck between the seat and the center console of my car, and all that metal stuff in between kind of just got scratched up right there. Usually, I've never seen these kind of cases get scratched up. Fortunately, only the case got scratched and not the G4, so that's kind of the purpose of a case, right? So let's go ahead and get this on and see what it looks like and kind of give you my thoughts on it since I've used it for a little bit. It does go in relatively snugly, and that's about it. I mean, there's not much to it. It goes in pretty good, and you can see that it does have the curve to it. It keeps with the curve, and it's going to have all the protection that you need, even if you want to put it face down. So it does look pretty good. I think it's a pretty good looking case for one, and I just like the design of this a lot. I like that two-tone, but it's got a good design here. It's got this recessed enough to where the camera's going to be protected along with these buttons as well. It's pretty easy to get to. You can still feel where the buttons are located as far as the volume and the power. It doesn't interfere with the camera quality at all. It works just fine. It is also raised above the screen, so you do get that protection if you do want to put it face down. But you can also you know, just know that it's not going to get all marked up in case you don't have a tempered glass screen protector like I have on this one. But I really like these cases. Varus has been one of my favorite case companies that have come out. In recent years, they actually leak out quite a bit of phone design leaks before they come out. So it's one of those kind of cool companies to kind of pay attention to because if you want to see the design of a certain particular phone, they're probably going to leak it. But anyways, like this is actually just a good case. I recommend it. I do regret that it does scratch up a little bit. But like I said, that's from getting stuck between a bunch of metal objects that are sharp. So it's almost like a given that's going to get scratched up. The only thing I've kind of struggled with this is that if you have a thick headphone jack or one of those auxiliary cords that have a thicker head on it. It doesn't seem to want to fit in this too well, but that's, you know, I would want this to be a little bit bigger, but it's not a deal breaker because I've been able to use it for the most part with most of my cords, but there's just been a couple that I haven't been able to use because this hole isn't big enough. So I would say that I would like to see this bigger so that I can use almost any size. I'm not talking about those monster size cables. I'm talking about just like a regular one that you can get like a cheap one at Walmart or something. But that's the only grievance I have against this. Thanks guys for watching this video. I really appreciate it. Share this with your friends and family. This could be a case that you might like for the G4. They also make a ton of different cases for a bunch of other phones. I'll leave a link down below in the description if you want to check out this case for yourself. Alright guys, I'll see you in the next video. And remember, stay techy. Yeah.